Una welcome this Nadi Good Morning Niger show. And we don't enter our first interview segment um, on top of this program. One starts to the look um, on do elections. People don't really talk about Edo matter. We go see the talk Edo matter. Because people say for the very first time, say the true um, you know, intentions of the people, the true wishes of the people, now in come to fruition for Edo State. Meaning to say, what do people get for mine? People will say Edo people want, now in they get. Now the plenty of Ibo will speak uh, for there be that. People they ask, say, hmm. I ain't go feel repeat the same thing for Ondo, but we also understand, say, election matter not be only I ain't business. People say follow. Uh, as soon as take corporate and as soon as take refuse to corporate, and uh, all of them will contribute to how I go take deliver. We could look on do matter as then self one start. And um, to discuss that matter this morning, I get for inside studio here two lovely gentlemen, Oga Kunle Ajayi, in the public affairs analyst. Now in the here this morning. Oga Kunle, good morning. Morning. I also get um, Oga Mayowa Ademoyegu in the politician will go join us for this show. Good morning, Ogadi. Good morning. Amazing. Hi, good as soon as take join us for this our program today. Everybody already say I said do elections be. You bless him in Nigerians, don't ginger. Say if not so elections they be myself. I go to step out uh, to come and contribute. Meaning to say, no, I go just sit down there. The person will be say, we sure say no go win. Go just automatically become winner. As Ondo owned on the command, just ask two of them a general question. How you feel about this Ondo elections? Uh, you feel say we will see a better um, electoral process um, than what we see for a do state? Or you feel say, get other factors when you go make this thing not possible? What do you feel? Uh, first and foremost, uh, as Ondo elections, they be so. Mm. We don't see the strong of that election. Okay. Because the local government elections they happened just about a month ago. Mm -hmm. And for that election, parties write plenty reports. Okay. One of those reports is that the current ruling party yes. in Ondo State used violence to rig all the local government elections. Hmm. Then for everywhere we rig, for me, I've been there Koya ward. Because I be saying a lot of word for local government, and even self till one o'clock, they no grip carry any ballot paper go any of the units, as we say also. Mm. And they even make sure say they no say our own candidate for uh, the, the party where I support go win the election. And a very small party, but they use force to make sure say they no even count the election. So the if on those state election go they peaceful. It could depend on those state people yes. if they come out to say we no want to rigging because it don't happen before for all those states. You get governors where we say they forcefully won't repeat the, 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 the class for mm -hmm. them. For, for during the Agago period, he used force, try to win election everywhere. You get it. And that same thing does they repeat itself as it be now. So the only thing where if you make this election they peaceful, we go they free and fair. Now, if you say make all those state people generally from unit to unit come out, say we don't want to fight, we don't want this thing. This election, we won't talk about issues, we won't talk about education, we won't talk about health care, mm. and all those who get things will go change our life. Never say you read my mind when I talk, say everybody would expect, say, you know, now all about INEC performance. Says INEC don't do it for those states, made them do it for Undo. But you also, like, I don't talk earlier, and you also don't even support, say, election will be just INEC business. Uh, I know if set everywhere, keep and uh, the voting will happen by themselves. Spirits no go down, a human being go down. And how we go take, put ourselves or coordinate ourselves, now we go determine the success of the election. Mayoga, uh, how you take it the matter, Oga Mayoga? So the truth of the matter is this I know has done credibly, uh, credibly well in this, uh, they just concluded their due election, at least to a reasonable extent. It might not be totally fair, or it might not be, or it might not be totally free. Mm. But then, every such light, all eyes on deck. All eyes are now on INEC. That yes, what happened in Edo State, for me, I can still relate what happened to Edo State to the fact that there is an incumbent. Mm. And that incumbent contested on a new platform. So that was why people, that was why people have been coming out to say, oh, the witches of the people uh, came into uh, our realization because INEC uh, delivered on what the people perceivedly yes. wanted. So now the same thing has to be repeated in on those states. See, one thing I know about on those state people is this. They are resilient. They are very, want, want anything on those state people want is what they get, no matter what. Try anything funny with them. They will stand by you. Remember the days of Urban Borio, Ajasin? And the funniest thing is, to what is the, the game being played now is just a bit similar 
So what happened uh, in those days? That was part of the Operation Wear Tear era, you know, that came, uh, that, that was, that, that happened, and you know, the attacks and all. So now, the measurement is the, all, all every, every apparatus mm -hmm. that INEC have to put in place to make sure that people come out, you know, the, the sensitization, both, both from the local, uh, both from the political parties, to the INEC, who is the umpire, to the observers who will be coming in, to every key uh, people that will be participating in this, the security apparatus especially. Yeah. Yes, the security in the United States was great. Yes, it sent a signal to everybody that no matter who you are, even if you, are, even if you work for a sitting government, uh, a sitting governor or for the sitting government, we will it good as you, it good as you bring out that security matter, but I want people on something where we say you talk, and I want to put them against what name, Oga Kule Ajayi talk. Uh, you say Ondo people, uh, they're, they're very resilient. Yeah. We say they're, 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 very, they're, they're very determined. Very say now waiting they want and then go get. But Oga Kule, you don't also mention, say, um, election don't been take place, not too far. And we see, say, even if they're determined, some other issues enter, cause wuru wuru inside the matter. So what that determination there, you know, the violence fits really disrupt things, as you don't already talk, um, say, happen. And when they look the reports, then when they come from um, Ondo, it's not too good. We don't hear about, say, thugs, when they arrest about 17 thugs, um, uh, you know, vehicle, they will be said, then destroy on top of the matter. Last time, less than a few weeks ago, we said, they say, thugs, then go block state assembly for the matter. So yesterday, for say, yesterday, for yeah. Equally, yeah. So oh, like, we don't just mention on do not toggery, toggery, violence, they come up for the matter. So if you understand as the trend done day now, you should say the true will of the people go reflect at the end of the day. You should say that their determination go see the light of day. If this, um, you know, hoodlums come out, say, now waiting our master wants, now we go see. How you take him? Uh, first of all, you see, the TV say, that election done day rigged already. Hmm. Why I talk say the election done day rigged, you say, if you look the people where they contest. Yes. They know they talk about the basic things where the people want. Yes. Nobody they talk about what they would do for education. Hmm. What nobody they talk about what they would do for healthcare. Healthcare yes. for all those states before everybody they happy. Your your pick, your wife will get belay for or uh, Lagos who carry and go in those states. But as it is now, all the three people where they contest, they know they talk about the basic issues. What they are talking about is ethnicity. Some come from Ondo South, some in uh, Ondo Central, and all of that, and they are trying to. Pitch people of Ondo South against Ondo Centre instead of talking about basic issues where go fit happen. So that one, fundamental in terms of value, mm. the election value don't go down. And if election value go down, it go affect the psyche of the people in terms of the defense of that election. Yes. People go they look and say, who I want to defend the election for? You get it? What to be the difference between these three persons? Mm. The two of them where they contest, they don't the government. Two of the three people with the, with the contest, they're not the government for the past four years. Get it? And they don't agree to do anything. The other third person himself, he did part of the former eight years where our people can't say we no want again with mm. the budget. So he give people very little choice as to what they feel they want to spend their life for. If you look at what they have for those states now, nobody say that they defend people now. People are not, they are just defending parties. Mm. What the party is just they do is they make our party plan, stay past their party. Now, why my prediction could be say that election people no go to come out, come vote. And now, why if you look at the government where they there now, this government is a government where they don't agree to do anything and they don't want to hear opposition. And as that government, that agree to the government where they there, so you get that is one of the governments where they the most backward in the history of the states. Mm. You get it. So, if say people get better option as it is now, that government is a governor. Because all those three people, no matter how strong you are, if they see a better option, what Mimiko was to contest, you get it, in 2006. All those people know, say, the guy no get money. You understand? But they don't look down. They say, this is what we want, and they, they went for it. Okay. You get it? But as it is today, there are very little differences from the three persons, where they go there. You understand? And so you go, don't be like, say, you they go from devil, you get it? To the deep blue sea. sea. Mm. So now that kind of psyche, now you go affect the. Okay, your, your prediction at this time, I say you didn't know. If you say voter turnout go day low tomorrow, and if you say on the people not to get you know better option as to who then go follow for this election. So so the, see, the, I won't agree with him that on those don't have that presently they don't have better option. Okay. Trust me. The three of them are good. Okay. Both of them are they've you know they've told they've they've told in their whole sectors of life, they've okay. come out and the person uh, PDP is projecting 
is equally very okay. A son, you know, he has every, but like I tell people around, even whenever I'm opportunity to so I say, see, Degede is a good candidate, but the timing might be shaky. You know why, like he rightly pointed, the, the, the campaign so far has not been issue based. Well, maybe, let's hope that there will be maybe another uh, round of debate, then let's see if they can now, you know, bring up well, issue based campaign. Well, we won't forget about that debate only, because yeah. you get one point where you talk. Okay. Uh, people go talk, what people won't hear. Yeah. So do the do, now be the issue. I yeah. know already talk to these three people now, one word, they don't, they don't put hand for government, they don't yeah. touch yeah. government. If yeah. one look there, which people they call the antecedents, the antecedent, where they don't know yeah. where they come yeah. from. Yeah. Uh, in So the truth, now I, I don't want to be partisan here. The truth is, Degede has a very robust, he has a very robust um, um, CV. Okay. He was with, he was with Primico for plus or minus six, seven years. But accomplishments, Uncle? Okay? Yeah, and when it comes to accomplishments, for, 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 yes, for, 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 yeah, but, yeah, for, let's say, if you could recall, yeah, when Primico gave me to government, six, there, uh, six months down the line, there was no appointment, let me remind you. So, but... But well, yes. how you will rate the performance? So while, while, I, while I will rate Jagadeh's performance is yes. this. Jagadeh delivered in the... See, the truth is, he was attorney general. He brought about laws that men, on those states today, they, they appreciate the fact that, yes, this guy was there. But, I will say this, he was part of... He was equally part of the government that left, that's Mimiko's government, mm -hmm. and that couldn't sustain you know see, see i tell people see to you to be a source uh, to, to you to be a success you have to produce a very credible successor mm -hmm. like he rightly pointed if there was no skirmishes if there was no you know reservations yes jagede was projected jagede will have emerged you understand but because they were tired or they were fucked out of the fact that okay let this mimico syndrome go then let another fresh air come in but then by the time the fresh air uh, got into power we, those states realize that, oh, this, this is not even a fresh air. This is just taking us back to wilderness. Mm -hmm. Election in Odo State, yes, everybody knows that. See, Odo State is a flashpoint. Mm -hmm. When election is coming, people are... And the truth is, because there's no, because there's no proper, properly laid manifesto in every of these political parties, see, everybody should come on board. Tell us what and what you even have to... Even if you want to come back and lie to us, at least still bring that position. Let us know what you are running with. Not that everybody comes to the podium today, you are yabbing or you are so abusing the next person. Now? Because if these three people don't already enter government and yeah. they don't carry anything, come. Yeah. They will go enter manifesto. They don't come talk anything. Yeah. Uh, that will not come translate to say, true, true, people don't feel confidence for this election. So the, so the reason why people... So if the process is not in the, is not in the hands of the political parties. Yeah. That's in the hands of the umpire. Yes. But in the, when we talk about candidacy, when yeah. we talk about... Or even the voter people, turnout. Or the to, po, vote turn, see, you predicted low voter turnout, good day. Yeah, there will be, there will be low voter turnout. What is your own reason? The reason why I, was, I said there will be low voter turnout is simple. This election, with the way I'm saying it, yeah. except if the security apparatus are well organized as they, as they brought them into Edo State, people will be scared to come out because, yes, there's tendency for violence to break so out. So your own are basically in a security or insecurity, and I'm going to make people there inside house. Nobody even say, the people will say they won't come out under rain or, or sunshine to vote for. No, 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 no. If you so, say other people so, get confidence for the people who say want they contest this election. Yeah, yeah. so the, the truth is, the Ondo state people... Oh, God, you don't agree? I don't agree. Why? Okay. Uh, see, Ondo state, I know Ondo state like the palm of my hand. Okay. As it is, you know Ondo state. Huh? Go look, I don't talk, the two persons where they're there. Mm. I carry the look for this past four years. Mm -hmm. If it is 100%, you give him just, not even up to 10%. Mm. Because if you look at, I don't tell you, health care. All the things we maybe could do for healthcare, maybe could get pass mark for healthcare. Everything we maybe could do now, it don't reverse. Education, it don't increase school fees. So they, when they say make it reduce, it even reduce one hundred thousand by hundred thousand. Let me say it reduce them with zero naira. You get that? The deputy where they contest for ZLP was with Akere Dulu for four years, and they still with him as deputy governor. All of them acted together. I can remember. When in 2018, August 1, 2018, as General Secretary of United Action for Democracy, I led a major mass action because you know, believe say, on those out eh? for the past 12 years, no gay light. And this current deputy governor, where they contest for ZLP, in your hometown, never gay light before. 
So you know jobs get different. So that's why if you say I just want the security matter, then go make people say no, that. So, 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 you know jobs okay. get different. See, you, don't, you know jobs get different between him and Akadu Dulu. And even Jagger said, if you could look at the content of what they talk, when you they talk about dissidents, before Jagger became Anthony General, the only thing you don't do, and if you look at a campaign, in talks, say, he don't be legal advice for one diocese in Adamawa State, say, he don't even work for one board of one university. These are not practical things in terms of real leadership. Yeah. You understand what I'm saying? My brother, got my wife. Okay, so I I understand the point he's no, trying I to. I, 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 I understand where it's coming. You said it's not lucky this time. You see, let me tell you. See, let me let me. You will agree with me now. I understand if, uh, the the part is coming from. But then, if we are to look at it, how do we measure uh, an, an an individual that incident, even before coming into governance? Like me, because we always say back then, me because we tell you, govern, uh, governance is a serious business. Mm -hmm. You can't just wake up and throw in the. You know, and you're like, oh, I want to be the governor of a state. Okay. This, the reason why I'm not attacking their personalities in, in terms of our antecedents as how well they fared over the years. These guys are successful in their field. But politically, politically, are they successful? No. So why I want to tell this part on that, on, on that is this. If the three of you you are contesting and you've been part of governance before. Mm -hmm. before. And yet, you are coming on board to say, okay, I want to continue or I want to come in, and you are not bringing in. See, when Mimiko was contesting, Mimiko, Mimiko had, a, had, he had a clear manifesto, a clearing act. He had all everything spelled out, a clearing act for all. He had everything spelled out. I was part of that government by God's grace. And I realized that, okay, so. Like, 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 if you are talking about the present government, so on those is a civil service state. Mm -hmm. Like most states in Nigeria. Like most states in Nigeria outside Lagos. If salaries are not being paid, how will the masses strive? See, it's simple. When I pay him his salary, it goes back to the market. Is that same salary he enters the market yeah, with? Is that same salary that circulates around, that goes to, you know, the artisans, that goes to every, every other places? That, you know, so if a government is refusing to pay salaries. What are you bringing on board? Okay. We could look this matter. What is the biggest worry for these Ondo elections where they come on Saturday? What do they give you major concern? For me, what is giving me major concern is security. Okay. Okay. Uh, my own lobby is security. Why you go talk so? We told this story about talk, uh, do this one, then fight, then destroy. You know, you don't worry you. See, make I tell you, mm. if you see these people where they fight, they yes. set to old scores. Okay. You get it? So don't be saying that the political masters and just I send them I on those states where okay. we're now. Old scores, neither they said to. Every town and villages and cities in on those states, mm -hmm. they get their own security, communal security. Mm -hmm. That's what we call it. You get it? If these communities agree on where they are going, you know if you bring any military or anything or any talk from anywhere coming town those states. On those states, they'll be like, oh, your state. They do what you call If you want to do talk, it's homegrown talk. Now, yeah. you say, if the homegrown talks decide, say, nah, like this, they all make it happen, this we are not going to vote for this person. Now, you say, why, 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 why are talks, say, those things, eh? those things eh? mm. may not work at the end of the day, you say. Even for local government elections, on the day of the election, mm. their talks, eh? no, if you do anything. Okay. The people will come do the work, na ODEC, that's the Undo State Electoral Commission, in conjunction with police officers, they have to be running away everywhere. They did. Because even the talks, uh, people plenty pass them. Because now small parties, mm. now they mobilize people come that election. You understand? But to even resolve security, eh? that's why it's, it's a very wrong way of analysis. If you take security as a, as a root and shoot of a matter, security is always an offshoot of a particular route. You get it? And the root, as in this case, is that the relation is amongst three contenders that are from the same uh, uh, non-idealistic leadership. Mm. You get it? Leadership that is not defined. And that's why Mimiko could not comprehend it to say that Takere de is a progressive. You understand what I'm saying? And if you look at all these three persons where they talk, let me give you a very basic example on, ed on education. None of them has a defined position on education. You get it? One, the, the highest of the one we talk now, the ZLP person. How would you rate that sector? 
Yes, the education sector, in fact, is, is, is a big sector that all of us, we need to put our searchlight on, especially in Ondo State. You know okay. why? Why? For this country, Ondo State gets an achievement of one of the most intellectual states okay. that you can talk about. You get it? From our old school people, there might be the new school now. Even from old school to new school, even as it is, I don't carry my friends go in those days before. We say they see all kind of people, they speak Queen's English. They could tell you, oh boy, if you look at even the rate of graduates, you know those states and Okada man, eh? you know if you see and say secondary school, if you see most of Okada people, you see them. So we're not facing a lack of education, and they cause this thug river where they see every No, now because of say EU based campaign no day you get a people they look and say oh yeah wait here jagged they want to do for me go ask a pdp person say go on facebook go check their debate say wait till your party go do no they go say day or day make a day my party so even day that's educated now why we say they no come come out focus follow the politicians and say give us this main matter then why we say they can't carry they'll first go block assembly they'll first go begin the bonbon car it's about somebody that is interested in really perpetuating himself at all costs okay, man, so man, if 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 I, if I will pick if i will pick from what he said mm. See, the truth of the matter is election, um, el el electionary system in Nigeria, every one of us will agree that forget it, no matter anything you put in place, see, security is paramount. It is. Because no matter what, see, well, even if you are contest, I remember the words of uh, Gulag Jonathan, Babatin. It was like, no, no individual's life worth uh, the election of anybody. You understand? So if he is saying uh, it should be an offshoot, see, you go back to, you go back, you go back to the grassroots. You have to do your uh, constant mobilization, orient your, uh, orientation and reorientation. You have to make sure that you even, even as a political party, you have to work on, you know, uh, conversing, mobilizing, bringing people out on that election day, having done all this. What are you giving them as, a, as an assurance that once they come out, that there won't be any problems? So let me tell you the truth, like he pointed. During, the, during this, uh, is it a month ago, the election, the local government election, uh, you agree with me? that there were, there were lo a loss of lives and properties. You agree with me that even some parties that, that were in that contest at the last minute, that the likes of SDP, if you, if you agree with me, at AAC, the last minute, AAC, ADC, at last, they all pulled out of that election. But AAC didn't. Okay. AAC didn't pull, but this guy pulled. SDP pulled. And why did they pull? Because, the, because of the level of violence that was being melted on their followers. Why? Just because of mere... The local government election. See, you will do your orientation. You will do your either issue based or not. We understand that in Nigeria, it is not even it is not even particular. It is not even peculiar to Ondo State. It is general in Nigeria. But our campaigns are not issue based. Yeah, clearly. Everybody come on. Everybody come on. Yeah, you just say what people want to hear. In fact, we even yab and dance. I we we will collect the days of a dancing senator. You just do things so that people just know that oh yes, it's more, then you start. See the crowd you will see in party A. That same crowd you will see in Party B. Yes, Yagede might not be 100. Aketi might not be 100. Uh, what's his name again? Agwala Jai might not be 100. But see, all these people, they have factors working for them. See, let us, let us be plain here. See, I'm a, practic I'm a practical person when it comes to politics. See, we'll come, we'll come, we'll talk about ideologies. We'll come, we'll talk about school of thought. But when they come back to the drawing board, does this school of thought, does it work? Does this ideology, does it fly? We'll come, we'll speak English. How many in English, how many English that has been spoken in the past has produced a well-defined, sound, sound leader? So what do we need to hear? What, what we mean? need to see, the, until we, until, let, I will go back to the youth. The, the youth need to start asking questions. The youth needs to start getting involved. The youth needs to start bringing it to the fore. Mm -hmm. What do you have to offer? Yeah. Having, having said that, then we now start to ask, see, we are, we are the masses. We are the ones that will go and vote. What do we start? See, I know we always bring in apparatus. See, let me, let me, let me tell you one thing. Audio, see, you will agree with me that to every low government election conducted, the sitting government of the day, as with, either with a 50 or a 90, they have the larger percentage to, to present the person that emerges at that election. You know why? Because they have every apparatus at their disposal. True. True. All right, Ogama, that is a very key point. I will take it as your, as your closing statement and a very important matter. I don't already talk to the youth must stay involved. The youth must ask them questions. We don't already understand saying that the same players we they see, whether we turn left or we turn right. Uh, and they go continue to tell us about who their brother be and who their sister no be. But if we not tell them what we want and what we expect, issue-based discussions no go ever lead it. But Ogama, okay, I think I get your parting words. What will be your take on this election? Uh, my, my take on this election is this. I, 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 I feel that 
own those people, youths and students, made them come out even if there is really no option among the three. Because I, I saw it when uh, 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 the gov governor increased school fees and wanted to contest again. He had to try to rejig all those policies. Why? Because are you just talk now I, I, I get difference with what you talk because it's not that people don't want to hear the issues. It's not about what they want. Why was it that the three candidates had to be promising this one? Jagada said he would, he would, he would, uh, he would reverse to the old fees. He couldn't say the particular amount. Agola said 50,000. But don't, for that one, it's too, it's too expensive in Ondo State. You get it? Of the three, none of them is. They are afraid of going beyond uh, 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 where these things are. They are afraid of saying, free functional education at all levels. You understand what I'm saying? Because in case of fear or the reality be say, you know they practical. No, uh, it's practical. Days. It's practical, my sister. See, How much do they generate <laughs> to start with? Let me not tell you something. That's where I had issues when he said Ondo State is a, is a civil servant state. It's not true. So revenue, uh, where let me say this. Let me say this. Let me say this. I grew up in Ondo State. In, in the whole of the Southwest, yes. in the whole of the Southwest, as at that time, mm -hmm. the Southwest had what you call the Undua, Undua investment. Undo State has its own separately, what you call the Owena Holdings, where you have what you call Polaris Bank today is an offshoot of what Undo State Old Bank. That's what you talk about, the Owena Bank, that later became Sky Bank and all of that. Mm. So Undo State used to be an industrialized so that's state. used to be now. Used to what, be, God now, bless it. Now, what, now, what is on ground now? Cool down, cool down. What I'm saying is that as analysts, we are supposed to be talking about what is supposed to be. Mm. Okay. You get it? Yes. Building on what their realities clearly, are now. Yeah, clearly. So, so clearly, what I'm so saying. So you're building on that reality. Yes. Do you see a reality of free education taking place? Yes. If you weigh yes. the see. revenue, or, I don't ask you that question before, say, in mm. terms of revenue, how much, in terms of IGR, how mm. much Ondo State they generate? To, 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 fund, to fund education in Ondo State. Yes. Today, the governor of Ondo State, in conjunction with some private profiteers, are making billions from quarry. In, on quarry alone, you can build five, six, seven more universities in Ondo State. The road that he did, the bridge he did in Ore, you get and, it? And this, that's and about this, seven billion era. Funds, right? It's not supposed to be more than 500 million era. The rest of the 6.5 billion era can build at least two new hospitals in each of the local And these are declared funds? Yes! This are state people already ask yes. the money Ondo State get money. See, see bros, I understand you when you say... Uh, when, when you say Ondo State... Yes, Ondo State... giving excuses for the politics. No, I'm not giving excuses for so the politics. So tell us... Let, let, wait, wait, bros, bros. Let me, let me, let me put I you... I contested in that state too. I contested in that state as well. So let me let me put you straight in one thing. See, governance is serious. And like I I take back again from the words of Mimiko. See. You will come on board. You will come with figures. In fact, you can start brandishing figures yeah. everywhere. You understand? Like what she pointed, she asked her a question. She was like, are these figures published? And when they are published, do you ask questions about these figures? See, policies will come. Let me govern. See, bro, see. Let wait. me respond with something. Okay. Is free health care possible? See, let me tell you why free health care is possible. No, no, let me, just answer. Please. Let me tell you why free health care is possible. I know where you are going back to. You are going back if to me. If you say free health care is possible, wait, why, let me, why is free education not possible? So let me tell you why free health care is possible. Mimiko showed us that free health care is you, possible. But are you in the know about so Mimiko? Stop giving excuses for every government. Were you in the, the, the current local government today keeps lying to everybody that free health care, free education, that it is neoliberalism that is possible. You get it? That real progressive governance is not possible. But even under Mimiko, where you talk in a civil service state, hmm? people they leave neighboring states to come born for that state. You, I'll wait, 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 wait now. Oh, Damn, my brother. Uh, this is question. No, it's not free. Not free. end this matter um, today. See, see, so please, see, before, before, you, call, before, before, you, before you before you before you take mm. me, let me just put something straight. Uh, How was Mimiko able to achieve the uh, free health care? See, it, Mimiko, because, Mimiko was because he sitting believed, down, like this he believed in the idea. He has the, instead of stealing the monument for the hospitals. He actually used those monies for the hospital. You said, not as I said, exactly. this is not talking about today. So, uh, well, this exactly. is people, people will want to steal money. Uh, now you go talk, see, this, free this, education, no day possible. See, this free talk, healthcare, no day possible. This talk is a very clear reflection of how elections go day. 
uh, for undominating to say, you'll find people say go come with their different ideologies on top of the matter to know how to move the state forward. You know, go soft uh, because as they don't talk, only people they very determined. And um, how I neg go ensure say everybody view and everybody choice they reflected on that day. Now we go one way to see if uh, I neg will give us 50% more of waiting than do for a uh, those states. My guys, I don't like giving this one. I don't talk this one. I don't really give Nigerians clear insight uh, into waiting. They don't already give us picture. So make we go beyond the name so they hear. Make we go beyond the party then we would they hear. Mm -hmm. See the matter where they really share yeah, really for on those states and see the matter that we say we suppose really address. Um, Ogakule um, Ajayi, I thank you very much. Thank you so much. As just for the good morning Nigeria show. Ogakule Ajayi in a public affairs analyst. I don't really hear him. Uh, clearly, in the saying be real son of the soil and say in no waiting day. We can really look uh, on top of the powder levels. And again, Oga Mayowa, Made Moyegu, he also journalist, he be politician, as you don't already hear, and two of them don't contest for that state. So you know the every, you know the inner workings. Uh, anyway, you carry come, go tell you the one way they behind those uh, particular matter. Who go fit talk and pass the sons of the soil um, themselves. Gentlemen, thank you very much. As I take journalists from top of this show. Munafisi, okay. um, also check out this our interview today and follow our social media handles there, because I know say many discussions, many comments go follow for this um, interesting discussion we get this morning. No, Miss Sam, add your own contribution inside. Who knows? We feel we we'll take phone call tomorrow to discuss this matter further.